Welcome back everyone. I'm meteorologist Matt Brooks and we do have some more fog in the forecast. We started off the morning foggy and we'll start off tomorrow morning foggy, but luckily it doesn't look like the fog is going to be quite as dense, but we could see some freezing fog with temperatures dropping a little bit below that freezing mark, but we should manage a little bit of sunshine in for tomorrow afternoon before more clouds move in and we will have more clouds to start off the week. Kind of an unsettled weather pattern setting up here. We do have some chances for rain, but I'll talk more about that in just a moment. First, I want to show you the visibility right now. Already seeing some fog across the Wabash Valley, about three mile visibility in Robinson, 10 mile visibility currently here in Terre Haute, and about four miles in Olney. I expect that the visibility could drop below two miles, so make sure you give yourself some extra time before you hit the roadways tomorrow. The winds Coming in out of the south southeast, anywhere from about three to eight miles per hour, adding a little bit of moisture, which will help to contribute to some of that fog development and the temperatures pretty close to that freezing mark, if not a little bit below in a few spots. It's 27 right now in Robinson, 28 in Terre Haute and about 30 in Rockville. Temperatures could drop just a little bit before all is said and done by tomorrow morning. So make sure you have that coat handy. I'm sure you've been wearing it the past couple of days. I may not even need to tell you that. Uh, the forecast lows for tonight, pretty close to what we're actually seeing out there. Seeing upper 20s, lower 30s, pretty close to that freezing mark, just a little bit below. And believe it or not, that's pretty close to average for this time of year. And starting off your morning around 8 a.m., still seeing that fog, but that should start to break up by 9 a.m., 10 a.m., not lasting into the early afternoon like we saw today, but we will have some more cloud cover moving in, perhaps a little bit of fleeting sunshine before we end out the day, then kind of a Another cloudy day setting up as we start off that work week. Uh, clouds and radar right now across the country still showing mostly clear skies for the eastern half, but over parts of Kansas right now we are tracking low pressure. Not a lot of moisture with this, but it could produce a sprinkle as we head into tomorrow night and early Monday. That's why we'll check out Futurecast. We'll start off at midnight tonight. This model's not terribly excited about clouds, but they will be there about partly cloudy sky cover at least by tomorrow morning, 7 a.m., seeing some of that fog move through. By the afternoon, starting to see that cloud cover, perhaps even a few sprinkles for our Illinois counties, but Indiana staying mainly dry at this point. Add your forecast for tonight, showing temperatures in the upper 20s, some freezing fog possible. Some of those roadways could be slick, so make sure you keep an eye on that. And for tomorrow, into the upper 40s, partly cloudy with a little midday sunshine. And for your seven-day forecast, we are seeing a warm-up into the low 50s for Tuesday afternoon, and we could see a slight chance of rain Wednesday. The significant chance of rain holding off until Friday afternoon and into early Saturday.